shocking result of Archie DNA test, has confessed in tears as blasted for banning him meeting Queen. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle knew that their decision not to attend Prince Philip's memorial service would look petulant and rude, according to a royal expert. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex were the only prominent members of the family to miss the Thanksgiving service for the late Duke of Edinburgh at Westminster Abbey on Tuesday. As many as 1,800 people gathered at the special congregation including the Queen, Prince Charles, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge with George and Charlotte, even Prince Andrew attended, arriving with the Queen by car, despite recent controversies. However, the Sussexes decided to miss the occasion and opted instead to stay at home in the US. It followed Prince Harry raising concerns for his family's safety in the UK without police protection. Royal expert Ingrid Seward told the Mirror she thinks the decision by the couple speaks volumes. Ms Seward said, what a missed opportunity it was not to bring Meghan and the children to join the extended royal family, European cousins and of course Archie's contemporaries. The only explanation is that neither one of them wanted to go. There would have been no security problems. The whole abbey was bristling with secret service men to guard the biggest gathering of royalty, politicians and top army brass since the London wedding of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge. Harry must have known it would look petulant and rude. And if he did not Meghan would have. She added, if it was a pointed snub to the whole royal family and it went sour. He will not get another opportunity to pay his respects in public to the grandfather who always supported him. He has upset too many influential people too many times. It is something he will live to regret. She said the couple also opted out of releasing a statement or tribute to mark the day but the Queen would have been told well in advance of their decision not to attend as Harry keeps in constant touch with his grandmother for many reasons. The royal expert said, the wall of silence was as loud as if they had shouted from the abbey rafters. The normal Eva Boast Duke and Duchess of Sussex said nothing. No spokesperson spewed out long sentences of undecipherable wordage. There were no flowers with the florist's name proudly displayed. No comments from Archul. Nothing. Not even a word from their supporters on various social media accounts. Criticism of Harry and Meghan has been widespread over their absence from the service and the decision not to give a reason or explanation for not attending. However, previously the Prince has said he would not return home to the UK until the issues of security are resolved. Meanwhile, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are asked to remain in the news for their association with the royal family. Pauline McLaren, Professor of Marketing and Consumer Research at Royal Holloway says, I think they need to really top up their associations with royalty. Because without their royal connections they really are nobodies in the US, which is where they're trying to establish themselves. I do think their unique selling point to put it in marketing speak is that they have the sort of humanitarian aim and of course that high profile. But the high profile is really because of their titles and their associations with British royalty. They're developing a kind of rival brand, or court, or however you like to describe it. But I do think the longer they stay away they lose that royal magic. She added, Harry and Meghan really need to have these royal connections and maintain them. The royals also need the diversity that the two of them bring, specifically Meghan, it was pretty sad they lost that. The advice comes after both Prince Harry and Meghan Markle decided to opt out of Prince Philip's memorial service over concerns of security.